In this video, we'll talk about learning styles to help you learn faster and smarter. As mentioned in the just concluded chapter, everyone has a unique style that works best for them. This explicitly connotes that learning styles aren't a one-size-fits-all kind of thing, because what works for a fellow may not work for the next person. What are learning styles? In a world where we're constantly exposed to need to learn before we can thrive, the system or the techniques that do help us to learn are the learning styles. Speaking of these styles, different experts have put forward several types. There are more than 70 different learning styles according to Vanderbilt University, and several schools of thought on learning have also suggested ample distinct types of learning styles. However, the four styles captured in the VARC model are regarded to be the most popular, and they are kinesthetic, physical, those who have this learning style learn best by being physically active, doing or moving. Reading, writing. Quite self-explainable, reading and writing is the best form of learning for those who have this learning style. Auditory, aural. Learners who have this learning style learn best by hearing. Visual, spatial. Learners learn best by seeing. When you look at these styles, do you resonate with any of them? There's a strong possibility that you will, and it's also possible for you to have a blend of the styles. Visual learning style. If you're fanatic about visuals and you prefer watching videos and love to see presentations that contain graphs, charts, and pictures, this visual style might be your style. You'll be able to take in and retain a lot of information much faster if you're a visual learner because visual information gets processed faster by our brain compared to plain text. Auditory learning style. There are some people who find it easy to learn what they hear. This kind of learner will go to classes and won't bother much about reading because they're sure they'll perform excellently by just listening to the lecturer, teacher, instructor, or later find audio to listen to. People who fancy listening to audiobooks and lectures find the auditory learning style to be quite apt for them. Reading, writing, learning style. People who have their minds easily imprinted by the words they read and write do enjoy reading and writing, and such people do have reading, writing as their most suitable learning style. If this is your main learning style, with little effort, you'll be able to retain chapters, paragraphs, and ideas. Kinesthetic learning style. There are some people who love to get active and get their hands on. People like this will find the kinesthetic learning style to be the perfect learning style for them. People like these are often fanatical about participating in experiments and practical activities and may tend to frown at theories. Tips for faster and easier learning. Number one, match your dominant learning style. It's high time you started working or finding out which learning style suits you best. And the way to do this is to start applying these techniques. As soon as you're able to find out your predominant learning style and you're applying it, you should also work on knowing the possibility of adopting other learning styles on some occasions. Number two, mix up your techniques. Mixing up your techniques can be very helpful in learning faster and easier. Breaking out of your normal learning routines is a great way to exercise, and this is the same effect that exercise has on growing and strengthening your muscles. Basically, the point is that you should exercise your brain by mixing up your techniques. Number three, improve your weaker areas. We all have weaknesses when it comes to learning. For example, let's say you realize that you're not much of a visual learner. Rather than just dismissing that as nothing to worry about, make it an intriguing challenge to improve. You can commence your journey to improvements by watching videos and the likes. Take note that learning will become easier for you as you strengthen your cognitive skills overall and when your attention is on learning itself. To get faster results, you'll be working on improving your weaker areas and getting better. Number four, for better retention, read out loud whatever you are trying to learn. A great way to retain what you're reading into your mind and memory is to read it out aloud. Though this may slow you down a little, you'll be the one to reap the juicy retention benefits in the long run. Number five, regularly test yourself. Testing yourself is a great way to boost your retention of information. Simply put, whatever it is that you feel you're struggling with, keep testing yourself to see how well you'll perform. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.